I'm Michael Arena, and I received care from the Maria Ferrari Children's Hospital. Michael um, was at home with us in January of 2020, and he suddenly had a grand mal seizure and went unconscious, and his lips turned blue and his eyes rolled back, and he was unconscious for quite a long time. Uh, and when that happened, we called the ambulance and he was taken to the hospital. So Michael immediately um, was taken to a main hospital, not a children's hospital, and he was transferred from that hospital to the Maria Ferrari Children's Hospital because the main hospital was unable to meet the needs of what was happening to him. They weren't sure if he was having a sepsis event they weren't sure what was causing the seizure disorder. The diagnosis um, was a little shocking. For us, it was a little scary because we, Michael had a brother who passed away from a brain tumor um, when he was six years old. And Michael was experiencing just about all the same symptoms that our son Jimmy had experienced. So we found ourselves in a situation where we were experiencing the same exact types of symptoms, so we had to rule out everything because of the genetics. And the hospital, having already known us, um, took exceptional care of our situation and knew how important it was for us to have an accurate diagnosis. So since Michael was diagnosed with a seizure disorder, he um, has been able to be on a medication that has kept the seizures under control, and he's able to lead a successful, normal life. The doctors and the nursing staff have been exceptional. The services there have made it so much easier to be able to know that in our community, we have some place to go where they care a lot about the children. During Michael's stay at the Maria Ferrari Children's Hospital, the um, Family Advisory Council was instrumental in making sure we received the care that was needed during his stay and informed everyone within the hospital at all times about where Michael was at and, and what was going on. And I am fearless for kids' health because, like I said before, children are not little adults. They need doctors, nurses that are specialists in taking care of children. It's a completely different person to treat. 